Okie dokie. So we've got this camera. Well, you might have to excuse the noise. I'm having to do all this in the motorhome. Uh, and obviously, Oot's got to come storming in here in a minute and make loads of noise and racket. But yeah, I'll try and get some stuff done. So what this is going to be, it's another unboxing session. Because I have just bought another car. <laughs> what do we get in the box? So the camera might be a bit wobbly because I've got it on a table, it? which is a wobbly table. Pretty cool box actually. It's a bit like a Tamiya, the old Tamiya boxes you used to get. So you get an instruction booklet and a little bitty box. And then in the box you get your power wagon. So, this one little car, it's well packed actually, a little Diddy controller, and so we've got the bits, 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 get rid of that. And then a bunch of parts for fitting on onto that. So what I'm actually deciding to do, I'm not actually going to build all the back bit on it. I'm going to keep it as it is, uh, just like this. I think it'll make it makes it a bit top heavy apparently. Um, so we'll leave it like that for now. To get into it, you've got little tabs here which you push in right there and there to open it. That goes in there. It's not as easy to take apart as the as the Traxxas one. And that's the insides. So it's permanently connected by the looks. So what we can do. You can just unhook the body by doing that. And that'll be the one which plugs together for the battery. That's for charging your battery. And this has actually got a, a switch underneath for off and on. Uh, just in there, this bit in here. There we go. Right, so I'm going to charge the battery up. So yeah, it does come with a USB battery charger. We'll see how quickly that charges up compared to the to the Traxxas. Which way is that going to go then? Good thing with this Swift Voyager is there's USB ports everywhere. Okay, that's, that's charging away. You get your little your hex spanner. There's a spare tie which goes on the back, which I'm not going to put that on. I don't I don't want the extra top heavy weight along with the frame as well. So I'm going to leave it off. I'm not using any of the stickers on it. So I'm going to do some kind of paint scheme. Uh, and again, I'm not decided what I'm going to do with that yet. And then you've got the little controller. It's quite handy actually, you can definitely easy with your thumb. And this takes four, four AA batteries in there. Uh, 